we're gonna get a more open shot case of being able to push them down without them being able to defend than this. Enigma is not so good because of Vengeful and Doom. Uh, even Pog. I agree with this game. Looking at Empire's lineup, is there a lot of nice stuff that you're looking to steal in these team fights, Purge? Um, like Ben said, too. Uh, Mike told me, oh yeah, he looks so dead. Ramses jumping in and pulls the fire, turn around with the action, the first blood there! Ramses oh, will go down. down! But they get themselves the first blood and. Santa does uh, synergize pretty well with the crit, since your illusions will get it. Maybe a bit underbuilt on PA right now. Okay, it's a very situational item on the hero. Salt lane. They're just trying to put a bit of pressure on Scandal. Actually gonna head up it now, Ramsey's jumping in. Here comes Scandal, drop of the Dream Crawl, he'll jump for as well, and Empire, we can find themselves a second one on the bottom lane too. Nice rotation from Scandal, we did see Scandal earlier smoking up around the- From Liquid, if they don't get kills to offset that a little bit, then it's gonna be hard to win the fights when they push the towers. It's about breaking the tempo here, here they go. Oh, Empire. Lane, straight in onto Micah, drop the crit, they finish him off quickly, they do get a telekinesis off Ramsey for the swap, saving the PA for the time being. Can Liquid move in even further, they're looking to chase down King R with the TP from Fada, they're looking at the bench kill, Cruel Do just come out on top there at the end, but Fada does uh, Winter, how do you feel about this uh, Vengeful Spirit skill of this game? Um, I do like this build because it does a lot of new damage, it'll be good, and lots of stun duration. Good against Lycan and Lone Druid, but when you have a PA on your team, I hear... Yeah, pretty much instantly. But they can also dive past, especially with an Aegis on PA. She can just see somebody and go in, like right now. Oh, yeah, I'm on Kuroki, gets the lift up, but straight away, Scandal jumping in with the side, there's gonna be the roll out, Kuroki's gonna live the top, but he probably gets taken down there, Doom. We'll take him out with the score shot for the high ground now with Poshka. See if there's a set up for the Doom, the Dream Call Stone will catch up the Mazuma Man, but he continues to run out to the left of the red ramp out control, getting splashed down there by the Infernal Blade from Doom, double kill from the Poshka. And now Empire, moving in for more, now comes the automatic for Doom, all to Jerex, Jerex can he take down as well as the third for the side of Empire, can they get more? And he's fighting the Mazuma Man left. Completely limits Winter Warren's ability to just kill us. Empire support, he's in trouble though. Oh, he is indeed. Telekinesis to lead this one off King Arm. He doesn't have a swap. Can he get himself close enough to stay around this King Arm? Up off the high ground. In fact, he might not even use it because Empire jump in. Dream Call Uncle 2. Kuroki, he's fine with the timing in the Golden Bridge, but this is still the back. He's the first time. Magnum is supplies for his Kuroki. He's going to go down the same time. Empire's going to trap Jarrett's up in the tree line. But no, the old comes down. Jarrett's is going to buy himself some time, but he's still taking that But to the man, they're turning it around, fighting himself. They will kill that chasing that round. This round is just a fly around the wall. Still chasing Jarrett. He will still go down to the boss. Can we get the final turn? Yeah, I call the point. He's out to like Ramses, he's heating up, he could be ready to come back in and try to help out. Our time is trying to kill the neck readings, but with the neck readings itself, it's too much. Ramses, last man standing, fire. Uh, oh, on the Lycan, you've got Necro 1 on the Beastmaster, yeah, eventually that'll be a level 3 Necro as well. And then when you've got two sets of level 3 Necros coming in at you with a push, what do you do if you're Empire? Well, at the moment, the Poshka jumping in onto Matumba Man, but this is a very, very greedy attempt here because there is back of him, and Poshka's on his own, he might get the kill, and Tumba Man fully looking, he's nerfed up for the walls, yes he can! The walls, they take his own life, so that will be denied in that return! So I keep on the jump is Shadow! Dream Call already ripped onto two! The back up's coming for his one, King Arrest is turning on Dan or Cross, jumping on the back, Dan Rest is on the final! He's got to shoot back here with the cold embrace, he's going to stop the damage here going in on Zapata. Kuroki being boarded up by the Nightstalker on the sidelines, but he's looking to come back in. Again, Scandal just throwing in the orb. The bear, it gets the root up, and it jumps away. He's very close to coming back in with Zapata as well. Scandal jumps in with a perfect fight. He's too tanky. The wind just goes down, and Scandal is not fighting away. Scandal's gone! Fantastic wind just goes there from Jax. Now Afterlife as well could be in trouble, they're trying to chase. Ramsey slowing down the bed of a panel strike, King Arms the River. For another way of the Terabyte Empire, they just need to get out. They're going around too long, they'll be picking up on the swap. Afterlife's getting by King Arms, gives his life now for the Night Stalker. And the plays are coming out, but at the end of the day... Scan is still out, but still Scan is going to jump through. But some of that's going to pop the Ori, going to try and run Dream Call onto two here. Afterlife, there's going to be a swap there to get ensure the Dream Call coming on the Tumalan. Just what? fights back, and my goodness! The bench is gone! Afterlife being chased down as well, but Tumalan is fighting on the pursuit. We'll see if they can do anything to do it. They'll drop the Doom onto Mind Control. They'll find one in return for the stolen Dream Call. For an animal to Ramses. Ramses trying to go up against this Jarrett with the Arctic Burn, slowing him down. The Posh can be kind of here by the Lone Druid. Ramses pops the BKB, jumps himself away. Still, the Vengeance is oh. gone! They're gonna get there! Oh, he's gone! It looks to have left out the last moment, but the damage to stop all the neutrals to stop them from running at him, but they just can't. And this bear even going to be in the oh, MTB. Oh, Harder's been jumping. 
Swaps in there by King Ackerman, finishing him off though, he's getting low, but the Wizards oh, goes to the roof! Right. He's trying to get himself away, he's sticking out of the top, coming through, he's actually gonna go down here! They'll kill the bench, but they lose the lone trade, and now it's time for Liquid to get themselves the hell out. Infernal Blade, cancelling the PP, Channel jumps up as well, they'll fight Jerich as well! Fantastic defense from Empire, with Kuroki going down here! It's this time, Liquid, the ones being... Oh, top lane. There's Gandalf trying to control mind control, but Tumanan coming in with the ult, he's got eyes on to King R. Look at these Necro units just running through, look how much damage they do, King R! He might just get taken out with the walls, the Necro units as well! Oh, he's gone! It's just too much, the damage is insane, it's Scandal. At the same time, looking for mind control, but he TP's out, the Yulks will be there to cancel it, he's kind of finished this one off, he's got a wedding rift, he's got the orb as well if he needs it, he'll throw it out, take down the Beastmaster, get himself away from the light. You can see now, Empire. No wonder if they're gonna wait for the uh, Aegis. Ah, oh, they're gonna jump in onto the Tumor Man, get a Dream Coil onto to him. Mepochka drops the boom onto Jarex. There's gonna be no Cold Embraces this fight for the time being. Mepochka though, he's getting stunned up and he's out of mana. The Doom stolen by Kuroki. The Tumor Man only just getting himself away. But meanwhile, he's just killing off the backliners. Finds the Doom, finds the and they're chasing him down. Give us the room. There's the room. There we have it. He goes BKB up, leaks himself away. Two afterlife, back to safety, but at the same time, Scandal, he's still on the back lines, and there's the Doom, stolen by Iggy Kuroki at the beginning of the fight we saw, and he saves it for Scandal. Another huge... I, I think the only way that these fights go a little bit better for Empire is as they initiate, they also silence the Lycan, but that isn't even a solution anymore because he has the Diffusal Blade. As long as he gets his ultimate off, the fight is really straightforward for Liquid. You run down the supports, kill him one by one, and keep your cores alive to the PA. I'm gonna stun the bear, but... I don't want to try and kill that, I don't want to try and kill the man himself. Jimmy on the Safada, but it's back up. Oh, he's he's gonna die. He doesn't have a BKB here with a bear. Taking it down, Ramses. He could probably strong life, get himself back up. And could get himself out of the radius further. Can he get himself back to base? Run it down the back of the bear. Fully rubbing out the roar. The report's going to Liquid. They're going to get the Doom as well. I mean, Ramses, it was a smart play from him. He was nearly ticking down to the burn. Turns and hits a couple of creeps to make sure he can survive through it there. With the Blast Lifesteal from Afterlife. Oh, he's gonna drop it on purpose. He needs to be alive now to defend the Rex. Unless see what he can do. Five out from Doom. Some of the man's silenced up. Ramses coming in, but the Telekinesis is there straight away. He's gonna be kidding. He'll finally get it up and then it's gonna break away. Oh, he gets the jump pass. There's Afterlife being chopped down by the Poshka. Doom goes on to four. But some of the man, he's still fighting on the Poshka. And the man around Ramses trying to jump back in with the Savage Draw. Pulls him away. Diffuse away from the two of them. So much again. That man's the Ramses. He's gonna go down. Jarex having to the man both load them in the swamp back of the bed, but Key, oh, he gets rooted, double kill for Kuroki, the mid lane's cleaned up, and G, G, well played, Empire yesterday showed us some top quality dose, but today, Liquid here, what a performance, and fast as well, truly, it was, I think that was kind of the thing, that's why they did expect, it was insane, and with the team play from Liquid, the Wyvern pick worked. You know, Jax, he knows what he's doing with his hero, and Kuroki Rubik. The Doom steals every fight. The, the turnarounds were there. What a game. Yep, the biggest thing was just that they prepped for that four to eight minute gank period, and Empire didn't get enough from that to get the PA super ahead, and as such, the Winter Wyvern countered him heavily, as well as the other heroes. It was just about